I bring you good news again in this channel on scholarship. One of Australian A-list universities, a prestigious university in Australia, is offering multiple scholarships and grants. And I said, let me share this good news with my community people. You know one good thing about this scholarship is that you will not be writing English tests. No English requires from some countries and most African countries are included. No English. Okay? If this sounds like something you want to hear, stick with me and let's dig in. Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, Jenkins Creation, where we keep it real. Thank you to my subscribers, you guys rock. I love you. And for the newbies, the newcomers, if you are new in this channel, please do subscribe to my channel and become a member of this beautiful family where we keep it real, okay? My name is Jane and I live in Australia. Thank you. Please do like my video. I know you will like it, eh? Hit the like button. And if you can, please share, share, share. All right. So today is about scholarship. Another scholarship. I promise you guys, I will always bring you good news on scholarship in this channel. So I found another scholarship. This time around is from a school. Previously, I've shared a scholarship from New Zealand government. I've shared a scholarship from Australian government. But today, I'm sharing information on a particular scholarship or rather multiple scholarship from a particular school in Australia. Have you heard about Monash University in Australia? It is a beautiful university. It's a very prestigious school. It is one of our A-list universities in Australia here. It is recognized all over. Anyway, every Australian university is recognized worldwide. So, but this one is one of our level one school, okay? Now, they offer full-funded scholarship for undergraduate and postgraduate studies. Full-funded tuition, you know what it means? To pay for your tuition fee for the whole year. Round about 40,000 Australian dollars all paid out to you. All you need is to come and study. I know some of you will still ask me about their flight tickets. But you know what? If you ever get a scholarship that pays your full tuition, international tuition fee, you have less worries. And with full funded scholarship, your student visa is almost guaranteed. Okay? Now, let's talk about this scholarship. So, this scholarship application has started. Now, how do we apply for this scholarship? Before I continue, I want to tell you that I will drop a link of all the information about this scholarship under the description section of this video. Please go to the description section and find the links. When you click the links, please read it very well. How do you apply for this scholarship? If you are not yet studying in Monash University, if you are not a student yet that you intend to study, you do not need to apply for the scholarship. Once you apply for your admission, they will add you to the list. Automatically, you have applied for the scholarship. So as you are applying for your admission, they are checking your documents. Of course, they will notice that you are an international student. So they add you to the list of scholarship. And if you let her get the scholarship, they will notify you. So this is not the one of how do I apply? No. The way you apply is by applying for admission. I'm sure that all of you know that in most developing countries, Australian universities demand that you apply for admission through an agent. I have showed you previously how to find an education agent for any particular school. I will drop the video again on description box of this video. Okay. This is the video. Please go watch it. This is the video. In that video, I've explained that if you go to any school and I gave list of Australian school, all of them, all, every of Australian school is listed in the link I gave you. And I'm going to drop that link again and I'll drop the video again. Now, 
I'm going to talk about two scholarships here, or rather one scholarship and one grant. But Monash University is saying that they still have other grants that once you apply for admission, that they will add you to the list. It means that you've automatically applied for this scholarship and grants. Okay. So when we talk about scholarship, their scholarship is for tuition fully funded and they have another grant. In the grant, they pay you about 15,000 Australian dollars to help you with your tuition and your study material and so on. So the scholarship is called Monash University International Tuition Scholarship, MITS. Okay. This scholarship is only for international students. If you are a domestic student, you will not get it. You see, I tell people, I have said it in this channel that so many Nigerians have chatted me, telling me they've gotten scholarship from Australia. Some of them got 50% scholarship. You know that is huge. But now they are looking for the part payment, the other 50% of their school fees. So, but they already have 15% scholarship. I know some of you, when you have 50% scholarship, it will go a long way because you already have something to supplement with it. But this one is a full-funded scholarship. Why not try? Okay. Another thing is that tell your agent, tell your education agent that you want to try Monash University. Okay. Give them that option and tell them because of the scholarship. They can as well tell you there are other schools. Ask your agent about scholarships. Ask them they know there are schools that offer scholarship. Okay, because these people that have gotten scholarship also got it through the agent. Most of the schools, when you apply for admission, they add you to all the scholarship you are qualified for. However, some of them you will go and find it yourself. Like this one today, I am telling you this so that you will make informed decision when you are choosing your school. One thing for sure is that Monash University is not a level three or two university. It is a level one university in Australia. Okay, it's very prestigious and recognized okay so the first scholarship is called monash university international tuition scholarship okay for 2023 and 2024 beyond so depending on when you apply the application process that is the admission uh, application process for people that will start their studies in july the application will stop 31st March of this year. And for people that will start their studies in January 2024, the application will start 1st of April and end 31st of August. And if you're already studying in Monash University, it means that you are going to apply because you have done your admission. So if you've already gotten your admission or you're studying, then it's you, this category of people that's supposed to do application for their scholarship. But if you are currently applying for admission, they will add you to the list of applicants. If you are doing a research postgraduate studies, master's and PhD in Australia for Monash University, okay, you need to meet the entry requirements. If you are going for PhD, you already have a master's. If you are going for master's, you already have a first degree, okay? And you have to express your interest to the research committee that you want to conduct a research if you're going for master's or PhD by research. Okay, further explanation for international tuition scholarship is purely for international students and you do not need to apply for it differently. As you're applying for your admission, you are being added to the list of applicants. More about the eligibility. Okay, so it's for international students and if you're doing master's or PhD, I've said it before, you need to express interest and tell the school you want to apply for research program. Then for the English requirement, if you have studied in schools from any of these countries, it means that you do not need to write any English test. Okay, so these countries are Australia, Botswana, Canada, Cook Island, Dominica, Bahama, Ghana, Lesotho, Jamaica, Kenya, Malawi, Sierra Leone, Philippines, Papua New Guinea, Nigeria, New Zealand, and so many other countries. So it means that you need to bring a proof that you studied in English and that's it. You don't need to write any English. Now let's move to grants. Okay. There are two grants here. 
I want to show you, okay? So the first grant is called Monash University International Study Grant for undergraduate and postgraduate students, okay? So this is for both undergraduate and postgraduate. If you are qualified or if you are awarded this grant, they will pay you between 5,000 to 10,000 Australian dollars for you to offset your study expenses. Now, the second grant, there's another grant I told you there's a lot. So the second one is University Achieving Potential Support Scholarship to help you achieve your potential is also for international students. If you get this grant, university will give you between 5,000 to 10,000 Australian dollars. Okay. Yeah. So you see grants and scholarship will go a long way to supporting you to achieve your study dream. Okay. I know everything is very expensive, but always aim for scholarship, always aim for grant. One good thing about these three study assistants I've mentioned here is that when you're applying for your studies, when you're applying for admission, you are already applying for that. Please think of Monash University. Consider Monash University. And that brings us to the end of this video. Please do subscribe to my channel, like my video, and I will see you in my next video. Thank you. Bye.